Hi everyone. Welcome to Storytime in Seacliff. And as we've said before, there'll be a story every day until we're all back together. Well, Oberon is eagerly awaiting. Uh, and I think many, many, many of you are able to tell us what the story will be today with yesterday's clue. Sure enough, it's if you give a mouse a cookie. Let's begin. This is one of those books that sort of starts before it starts. We have over here our little mouse coming, coming over the hills and dale, uh, and he's wearing a backpack. And sure enough, on the title page, we have a boy, and he's having a, a, a cookie snack and reading a book. Uh, let's call the boy Graham. So sure enough, Graham and the mouse meet up in front of Graham's house. If you give a mouse a cookie, he's going to ask for a glass of milk. And when you give him the milk, he's probably going to ask you for a straw. When he's finished, he'll ask you for a napkin. And then he's gonna to wanna to look in a mirror to make sure he doesn't have a milk mustache when he looks into the mirror. He notices his hair needs a trim, so he'll probably ask you for a pair of, of nail scissors. When he's finished giving himself a trim, he'll want a broom to sweep up. He'll start sweeping. Mm, he might get carried away and sweep every room in your house. He may even end up washing the floors as well. Whew, when he's done, he'll probably want to take a nap. You'll have to fix him up a little box with a blanket and a pillow. He'll crawl in and he'll make himself comfortable. He'll fluff the pillow a few times and he'll probably ask you to read him a story. Yes. So you'll read to him from one of your books and then he'll ask to see the pictures. But when he looks at the pictures, he'll get so excited, he'll, he'll want to draw one of his own. And he'll ask for paper and crayons and he'll draw a picture. And what a picture. Whoa, when the picture is finished, he'll want to sign his name. I think it's his brother, his mother, his father. I think that's his sister. And there, there's the mouse. He's gonna to wanna to sign his name, as I said. And sure enough, he needs a pen. He'll ask you to hang his picture up on the refrigerator, which means he'll need a piece of tape. Yes, he'll hang up his drawing on the fridge and he'll stand back to look at it. And looking at the refrigerator will remind him that he's thirsty. So, look at how tired Graham is. He's going to ask you for a glass of milk. And chances are, if he asks for a glass of milk, he's going to want a cookie to go with it. Oh no, look at that mess. And look at how tired poor Graham is. And the mouse, all the mouse wants is a cookie. Okay, that's the end of the story we had today. Fun, right? Well, time for, ah, time for our birthday cake. I have it mostly chocolate because of yesterday. But today, from what I've heard, from all of you out there, it is a tie. We had the same number vanilla, the same number chocolate. However, at the very, very last moment, I had gotten a vote for vanilla. It was Molly, again, voting for vanilla. And we're lucky to have a birthday. Uh, it was actually, it was last week, but we didn't have a chance to sing 
to Ellie. So now we're going to sing to Ellie. All right. One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Ellie. Happy birthday to you. Okay, very good. I'm going to put the cake down. Don't forget, send me your choices, vanilla or chocolate. And what do you think? What do you think about this? This is the clue for tomorrow's story. All right, guys? Think about it. Okay. So goodbye, my friends, all of you out there. Remember, remember, I love you all. And uh, we'll be together tomorrow.